In a few days, most people in Poland will celebrate All Saints Day, but some will celebrate Halloween as well. Are these two holidays totally different? Or perhaps they have something in common? Let's try to find out. Halloween originates from the ancient Celtic fire festival called Samhain. Samhain in the Old Irish means summer's end. The Celts who lived in what is now Ireland, Scotland, Wales and Northern France divided the year into the light half and the dark half. Samhain marked the end of summer, the harvest season, and the beginning of the dark and cold winter, so it was the transition from light to dark. The Celts used to start celebrating this festival at dusk on October the 31st with huge bonfires to welcome the new year, which fell on November the 1st. They believed that on the night of October the 31st and November the 1st, the boundary between life and death was at its thinnest and the souls of the departed revisited the earth. It was believed that mischievous spirits that wanted to take vengeance appeared on that night as well. As a result of the Roman invasion of Celtic lands and the spread of Christianity, pagan Simon was gradually supplanted by Christian rituals. In addition, in the 9th century, Pope Gregory IV moved All Saints' Day from May the 13th to November the 1st. As you remember, Samhain fell on the night of October the 31st and November the 1st. So, from that time on, All Saints' Day and Samhain coincided in the calendar. Probably it was done to eradicate Simon completely. Interestingly, All Saints' Day was also called All Hallows' Day, because hallowed means holy. The day before All Hallows' Day, which was October the 31st, was called All Hallows' Eve. All Hallows' Eve. Eve means the evening before. Finally, All Hallows' Eve was shortened to Halloween. Over the years, Halloween became a secular holiday. Its name originates from Christian All Hallows' Eve, but many of its rituals originate from pagan Samhain. For example, modern-day trick-or-treating has its roots in the tradition of preparing food for the ghosts by the Celts. The Celts were afraid of the mischievous spirits and they wanted to appease them this way. The custom of dressing up in costumes on Halloween originates from pagan Samhain as well. The Celts put on masks and costumes because they didn't want to be recognized by the ghosts. They wanted to look like them. I will give you one more example. A modern-day jack-o'-lantern has its roots in the tradition of lighting lanterns and bonfires by the Celts on Samhain. It was supposed to protect the Celts against the mischievous spirits and give them the sense of security. After all, All Saints Day and Halloween have something in common. Both holidays are about afterlife, but celebrated in a different way. Halloween is the time when people have fun, whereas All Saints Day is celebrated in a serious way, at least here in Poland. On that day, people dress elegantly, visit the graves of loved ones, light candles and pray for them. So, the nature of these two holidays is different and that's why there is so much controversy over Halloween here in Poland. I hope I gave you a closer look on the origins of Halloween and its traditions. Thank you for your attention. See you later. Bye-bye.